for, a, for books you were writing. Yes, uh -huh. I've written a couple of books featuring world-class con artist Radar Hoverlander, uh, which I just decided such a great name needs to have a larger-than-life career, so I decided I'd make him a con artist. Started doing some research, learned a thing or two about cons. Next thing you know, I'm an expert, at least a self-described one. I, okay, hey, self-described or not, people are falling all the time for internet scams and it's not because we're not smart and savvy it's because there's so many different ones that are out there mm -hmm. and so many ways that people prey on sympathy you know predicted when there's a world historical event like this earthquake and tsunami in japan the scam artists will follow right in behind selling earthquake detection kits uh uh, radiation proofing, radiation proof your house, only $99.95. Your house doesn't need radiation proofing, but if you send it $99.95, I promise you'll never see it again. <laughs> that, there you go, it can disappear, it's a magic exactly. trick. Exactly. You're at the gas station, and you I've had this happen before. You say that you can be there and people come up to you with a sob story, maybe their mom's in the hospital. Yeah, see, con artists prey on a, a range of emotions, everything from fear to and everything in between. Now, the one we're talking about preys on the emotion of sympathy, helpfulness. Someone like you comes up to me, you're well dressed, you look good, you look smart, and you're telling me sincerely a story about how you lost your wallet, you left your cell phone at home, you're out of gas, you're going to see your mom in the hospital, and you need 20 bucks to fill up the tank. And if I give you 20 bucks and my business card, you'll send me a check as soon as you get home. Well, obviously, it's like the radiation detection kit, you're never going to see a dime. And you're saying you'll see the same woman at the same gas station next week. Next week, week uh-huh. Internet scams, of course, you get these letters from Nigeria, people are saying that, you know, huge amount of money. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, obviously, all of that is baffle gab. It's a wonderful word to describe things that are not true but sound true. Baffle gab. Y you wouldn't fall for it. I wouldn't fall for it. But you look at it this way. With the click of a mouse, the con fellows can send out a million emails. And if one-tenth of one-tenth of one percent responds, they get rich. So it really only takes one sucker to make that work, which is why the Internet is such a wonderful uh, venue for cons. They don't have to do it one at a time anymore. I'm not going to fall for the hat trick, but <laughs> but let's show everybody else to see if they will. This is just a little thing you can do in bars. I don't even call this a con. It's more like a, 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 a proposition bet or a fun game you can play in a bar. Okay, the way it works is like this. It's called the hat trick. <clears throat> now. I bet you that I can drink that shot of whiskey without touching the hat. Does that sound like something you think I could do? I'd like to see you try. Well, it so happens that I have a magic straw. It's made of the newest nanotechnology, which is why you can't see it. Okay, so what this magic straw will do will actually allow me to extract the liquid from the shot glass without moving the hat, without touching mm. the hat. Uh -huh, you're skeptical, mm -hmm, I can tell. Mm -hmm. But let's just see if it works, okay? <laughs> magic straw. <laughs> That's the good stuff. And I'll put the magic straw away, and you can see for yourself that I've drunk the drink without touching the hat. Hey! Uh -huh. Works every time. Works every it all it <laughs> actually works almost no time. No time. But it's a lot of fun to do. I want to talk about senior citizens because you're saying that it's so easy for them to fall prey because y you get into maybe more of a trusting mode. Yeah, uh, seniors across the board have conventional problems. They're more trusting, they're not as skeptical, and they're simple very, very strong. So you could have somebody call you up on the phone. This has actually happened to me. Somebody called me on the phone and said, we have um, footage of your grandson shoplifting a Whopper from a, from a uh, Burger King. Well, I don't have a grandson, but if I did have a grandson, and the next thing I heard was, for $50, we can make this problem go away. I'm a, a doting grandparent. I'm going to send the 50 bucks. Now, that's just one version of it. I could be selling things on the phone. A guy called me on the phone one time. He says, uh, how do you normally invest your savings? I said, well, I normally invest them in rent. So that was... And food, uh, the yeah. two things so, that I love. So that was the end of me. But, you know, people do have savings, and they will fall for deals like this. So for seniors, for anybody who doesn't trust their own instinct or thinks that at some point in the future they might not trust themselves, you get a buddy, a consultant, so that your rote response, whenever anybody tries to sell you anything, and I don't care if it's internet, phone, door-to-door, -door, you say, I have to talk to my consultant. And it just becomes a habit. And you establish that habit now while you're sharp, and it stays with you later on when you might not be quite as sharp and you might be a little more. John, thank you so much. We've got information how folks can go meet you tonight at 7 o'clock. And uh, we're going to offer some free copies of your book to our viewers. So guys, just go to San Diego 6com click on rewards, and the Albuquerque Turkey. We can learn more about all your interesting writings and all the con, art con artist scams that you write about. John, thanks so much for coming My on My great today. pleasure. Thank you. All right, more information, you can always go to our website at San Diego 6com and click on San Diego Living. And we're back right after this. Okay, let's see what's coming up tomorrow. We got the golf card, the golf card, rewards. 
wedding.